Eh. Both finalists will go on. Yup. Yup, yup. Yup, or yup. So I suppose we go to the next dungeon now. And it's actually not too far from this build. Remember the Lost Woods? But well, now, it is the Skeletal Forest. But where is the Skeletal Forest dungeon? That is the trickiness of it. The bee's following, but not for a good reason. Death to the bee. Death to the bad, bad bee. You should be gooder. Maybe, bae. You should be nice to us. Oh wait, this is that one moth boss that's how I saw the golden bee. Ah, moth boss. Oh boy, what do you think? Should we go and get the golden bee? Hmm. Not worth it. Nah. Okay. Yeah, especially when they have Just the catching regular bee. And we can test it out. Apparently, the only boss that's affected by bees is this one. Mothica. Something like that. Yeah. I think they probably took that from Twisted Gothic or something like that. I don't know. Anyways. So, now we just have to figure out our way across. And to the. You die, you like like Pumpkin like like, or whatever you are. You're not stealing anything from me. That was actually kind of awkward. It's like I, I just used a hook shot and it like froze just before it took something. Hmm. We appear to be stuck. Oh, we just lost in randomness. Lost in randomness. Can you do anything with these skulls? The larger ones? Some of them are entrances. You can tell because they're a mouth of me. Ah. And I think I entered the wrong side of the forest. Well, perhaps you can switch over to the light world and go to a different head. Well, no. No, that won't help. That won't work. Because there are no portals in yeah. the lost woods. So, we have to find another entrance. Fortunately, Tal's not too far either. So, how about we try to go back to town? I feel like we're missing something in town. You're thinking of the fourth dungeon. No. See, here we are. I mean a heart piece. I think there's still one left in there. Oh well. My left arm I'll probably arm think is of it twitchy. later. Why is my left arm twitching? Because That's some awkward. random guy is shaking. I no, no, it just it's twitching for some reason. It's just so weird. Anyways, technically we are at the third dungeon. Huh? Third dungeon. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of different sections for it. Oh it's yeah, this is that messed up one. Yep. Oh yeah, you can also cut the curtains here. Well, quote unquote curtains. curtains. But they don't do it. Yeah, that's just fun. It's a magic gate. And fire. Don't kill it. Da. Uh. Yeah. Fine. Perhaps I should turn a lamp on to lighten up this situation. Maybe I should really actually push the button to activate the cape. That would work too. Hey, look up chest. Compass. <laughs> Look at the redhead. Um. <laughs> Wait for it. How come all those opened? <laughs> Who cares? It made the enemy fall. <laughs> and apparently this place is only two floors. Two basement floors? Two basement floors. That was fun. This seems like it should be a short dungeon. That was fun. I just was watching him fall. That was fun. That was awesome. Zombies. Apocalypse. And the hook shot has like no effect. Zombies. 
a possible. Yep, the boomerang still works. Although I don't know if the regular boomerang does. Magic. The magic boomerang, however, works. Allies. Oh, I hate this dungeon because of that stupid hand. Like, oh. If that hand grabs you, it takes you all the way back to where you started. You might remember it if you played the future Zelda games like Ocarina of Time and such. I think they also have those in Legend of Zelda 1 in a way. Yeah, the original NES, they, they grab you from the walls instead of the ceiling. But it looks like those, Sean's about to die. You whack those hands as many times as you want, it's gonna come back. Yep. On this one. It's just... It's just annoying. Okay, yes. But I guess that's the fun of it. Yeah. You got spikes, you got bumpers, you got zombies, and you have an annoying hand. Anything else you'd like to bring along? Yes. I'm off. Oh, please. Who in their right mind would bring them off into this? That's, oh, you're right. Nobody. Someone in their wrong mind would. <laughs> Fatal frame reference. My eyes. My eyes. <laughs> anyway. I still have thoughts about that scene. <laughs> Seriously, out of all the fail frame scenes, like there's a video I've seen that talks about the scare top ten scariest fail frame scenes. Yeah. That one is the only one that seems scary to me actually. The blinding ritual. That's the only one that seems scary to me. I wouldn't want that to happen to my eyes. You know what I? We're making a whole lot of everything but Zelda references in this. <laughs> what do you expect? I mean, we aren't the guys who made the Legend of Zelda games. Ah, shoot. Snagit seems to have cut us off. Oh boy. Heads up. Hmm, floor change. Map! Map now you can see all the rooms. Notice now there are not uh, just one entrance, but three entrances. No, four entrances, it looks like. And there's only one room in basement floor, too. The boss huh. room. So, there you have it. Only okay. one room in basement, too. <laughs> Did you see that? Did you it see what like happened to that bumper guy? <laughs> Did you see what happened to the bumper guy? What? Huh? A moment ago, there was a blue guy, a blue bumper guy, standing like right here. I passed over two of those. One just opened up a little chasm, yeah. and then the second one closed that chasm back up. By the time that second chasm closed, he was already falling into the bottomless pit. Right on. Failure for him, sweetness for us. And full of fun, too. Have a nice fall. See you next fall. And then, oh. well, no, I wouldn't want to make a Mark Riley reference. <laughs> oh, really? Would you? No, well, I was going to, but You're not this sure. doesn't seem like the right time or the right place. Pull the switch. We pull, were talking pull, pull, about pull, pull, falling, pull, pull. so I was gonna say something about Miki falls, but um. yeah. As you can see, this wouldn't be the time or place because Mickey Falls would have absolute no references to a Zelda game. Or, then again, what have we been talking about that deals with Zelda? Yeah. Let's keep it. Got nothing else to do. Talk Absolutely to not. I shall force you to. And then we got a kid griping with his hands about the lights. Apparently it's blinding him now. Sit down, you fool. What a fool of a took. Go to bed. Okay, then. Agree. You must see to know what we are doing, kid. 
<laughs> Curse you, Snagit! And now we had ourselves a mild disturbance. Yes, we had a mild disturbance. But we got some ice cream out of it. Yeah, we got ice cream out of it, so it was an okay disturbance. Anyway, Let's do this. Yeah, that, we're continuing on. I can't exactly remember what we had been talking about, but... Oh well. Oh well, yeah. New mods is jam along to some music. Cause why can't you? It's not like you people hear it. So. Yeah, we're just gonna go through this dungeon here. Um, we do not have the big key if I remember right. Nope. So, yeah, we. I think we had just explained how this dungeon is split up into multiple sections. different sections. Yeah. And now we have to go find another part of the section. We're just going to randomly fall into holes and hope we get lucky. Oh, yeah, we're fall. already in here. Yeah. Apparently, our luck has run out. Greed. Ah, yep. You guys just fell. And we have no Ferraris. So this might be dangerous. That was a fail. I used a magic mirror and I ended up right there. Well, I guess that was sort of the way you entered. Fail. Correct. It was a fail. So, we are looking for this Unknown way. What? Some of the songs I listen to, I just can't help but sing along, alright? If you can hear me, folks, you know what? I don't care if you hear me or not. Man. Shouldn't you be a bit more subconscious of other people's YouTube channels? <laughs> Sorry, boy. Music, it really gets a hold of me, alright? Feels oh. good. Everyone will just have to deal with it, because that's just who I am. Even you will. I told you I'd be listening to music, and I'm gonna listen to music. You're not stopping me. Hmm. Next. So, yeah, we're gonna have to find us a new entrance here. And, yeah, collect hearts along the way because yeah we have no Ferraris. Uh, grumpy. I and he got out a bomb. But that bomb was red. Do you think suppose it was a super bomb? No, it flashes red. Oh. Ah crap, that just means I released a spoiler. Yeah, we we get better bombs later on. Not really one that we get to keep keep, but like we temporarily get to use it. Correct. But it's really useful. Eh? From what you told me, it's the only Sabam in the series that is actually red. In the yes. entire Legend of Zelda series. That is red originally and not like, just because it's flashing. Yeah. And I think I just backtracked myself. Perhaps you have. Yep. Yes, she did. That just means you can go back after we get walk to the parents. Start from safe place. So back it. So that saved a lot of time. Yep. Came on the side there. So yeah, finding the right entrance might take us a while. So yeah, we're just gonna be looking for that. I'm going down and hopefully not die guy. by some pitchfork man. Yeah, fortune's helping. Yeah, that'll help us heal us. Oh, 
Let's see what he has to say this time. Hocus Pocus, you will find the Smith's partner in the village of outcasts. Now I will take 10 rupees. Hope you'll be healthy. Yeah. Okay, why are we looking for the Smith's partner? Mm. Oh, very scary. Ferraris! Ferrari. 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 Okay, we accidentally grabbed one, but we netted the other, so. Keep it in the bottle. Oh, 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 oh. We got one for Rary. And we're at full health again. Hooray! We have not been in full health for the longest of times. Which means we can use the Master Sword to its full potential. Mimathon! And none of you javelin throwing freaks are going to stop me now. So, continuing. A lot of rocks just randomly placed in a row, isn't it? No matter. We're continuing on up to the Lost Woods yet again. But skeletal it's not, forest. yeah, it's the Skeletal Forest, not yeah. Lost Woods. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Uh, first got lost. So, now we can get lost again. Get lost again. What is wrong with us? Nothing in particular. I mean, in the light world, it is the Lost Woods, isn't it? Maybe you're supposed to get lost. That's horrible. What a horrible way to die. Death by getting lost. That's horrible. A death for getting lost. Yeah, you're lost. And you can never find your way back out. That'd be a whirl. I suppose so. I guess you'd go mentally insane before. You wouldn't even remember that you were lost in okay, the first let's place. Let's see. Eh? Yeah. <sighs> what is going on here? I know where the other entrances are. So why can't I get to it? What's in Dairand? Perhaps go north. Come on, yes! Okay, that was really lucky. You think? Um, so yeah, I, I believe Lifeline just glitched the game. Do not attempt that when playing. Okay, that guy just throwing bombs, arrows, and he's still in a whole bunch of my stuff. Get it back. I just got back one bomb. Well, that's not stupid. exactly fair. And we're killing some type of plant with plants. Wouldn't that be like uh, it's not betrayal? Very effective. In a way, it would be like portrayal, but betrayal. Betrayal. Yeah, betrayal. 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 Attempt. He's trying to glitch the game in front of human eyes. <laughs> no!